Hi there, it's Sunday, August 11th. It's about one o'clock. Uh, I'm in Savannah. I have a different golf club, but still a golf club. <laughs> uh, I was at the neighbor's lot earlier today, um, weed whacking. So, uh, just doing a walk through here. Apologies if you see dog poo. This is the dog side. I haven't been down here and cleaned it up for a little bit, so I was just trying to get... This is the pile of the branches that had dried out from before, and this is the pile from the bush that I cut down just uh, last weekend, was it? Was it a week ago today, maybe? I'm not sure. But, and then, oh, big pile of dog poop. But, you can see, those are all paving bricks that I've pulled up from along here, and then under these weeds, there's more paving bricks that need to come up. So, and then there's some branches from some random trees that have grown through. But, um, yeah, so I'm going to do some burning. And maybe, I'm not sure, um, pull up some of these pavers and pull some more of it out. But this is kind of where I want to start putting the grass seed. But I need to get more of the rocks out. So, but, yeah, so that's what I'm going to work on now. Weeds everywhere. But, anyways, later. Hey there. It's 4 o'clock on Sunday. I'm exhausted. I got rid of the pile of um, branches. Got them all burned. Found a random oyster shell. Not sure where that came from or plastic bottle. I did see two snakes garden snakes go in through the crack in the window into the basement and my first thought was that's interesting and my second thought was they better be eating the bugs down there I should probably be you know concerned <laughs> but yeah I don't care so <laughs> so and I did find two buckets they were up there up there by the chair so I made use of them and um, or at least this one was, I pulled some weeds and used it to haul. So the burn barrel is pretty much burned down. So I got rid of the pile of branches here. Um, and uh, this garbage can was over there and it was full with another load of the branches that I cut from the neighbor's tree. I did not get any of the paver stones pulled up. I did cut um, three branches down off the lilac tree that were hanging over on the side. And then the tree that was growing up here, I did to get that cut down. The only thing is the root is on this side, but it's growing on that side. So it's kind of grown through the fence, so I'll have to figure out how to how to rectify that problem. So I do need to get in here and um, rake everything out. I just don't have the energy. Um, and I've got like three buckets of these. Th these are just random bricks and rocks that I have pulled out of just this lower section. I mean, I just, I, I don't understand the former owner's fascination with rocks and, and stuff, but yeah, and then the front is all crazy. And then I was watching Rainbow. She was digging a hole so that she could lay in the dirt while I was out here burning. But she's inside now. I would like to do more, but my body is, um, <laughs> it's giving out. It's just like, yeah, no. Between doing the neighbor's lot earlier 
and what I've done here yeah no I'm done I still need to take the dogs for a walk so um yeah I'm gonna call it a day there are still some branches these are the green branches that I cut down the lag like ones and then that tree I cut down but there's no smoke so I don't think they're gonna catch but I can see from my window where I sit in the living room um, the smoke from the burn barrel so I know I'll know if it's doing anything so I'll keep an eye on it but yeah no I did pull some weeds from up there that's what I used the bucket for but yeah I'd love to do more I mean there there's no there is no shortage of stuff to do but yeah my body my body isn't gonna handle it so anyways later